everyone and welcome back to the channel or welcome if you are new. I'm Eliandra and welcome back to another CZ haul video where I'm going to be going over all the new CZ items that I've been downloading over the past month or so. It's actually been quite a while since the last one. I thought it had not been that long but it has. So I have a lot of new stuff, a lot of new amazing hairs and everything she's wearing will be featured in today's video. We're using Dahlia today as our CC model. She's from my Three Sages cast video, and yes, she's a spellcaster, so she will be doing the spellcaster animation, so just ignore those. But anyways, if you want to see more CC haul videos, give this one a thumbs up, and without further ado, let's get started. So as always, we're going to be going through this in categories, starting off with the hair, and everything I'm showing you guys today is linked down below in the description box. Anyways, this is the first hair. This is the Nila Nela hair. I'm not sure how to pronounce that one. It comes with a headband that you can change the color of in the hats category. It also comes with an ombre accessory like a lot of the hairs I'm showing today. So you can add this in or you can choose to go without it. This is the hair without it. And it comes in loads of different swatches. So you have like so many options with this hair. Next up, another hair from the same creator. This is the Huma hair. This one is super cute with the little space buns and a lot of hair, a lot of curly hair. And again, this one also comes with an ombre accessory. You can choose to add on if you would like in the same colors. Then we've got this hair by OK Roo. This is called the Venice hair and it's so cool. Again, I love the curls and it has a headband that is here in the hat category. You can change the color if you want. Next up, we've got the Stacey hair. As you can see, another ombre. I love ombre hairstyles, so what can I say? I download all of them. So this is the ombre accessory, again, in the same swatches. This is the Alice hair. This one does not come with ombre, but maybe you can find an accessory that works with it. Really cute, wavy. I like it a lot. Okay, next up is this clarified hair pack by Cotcat. I used to download all of his clarified hairs. I was obsessed with them and he stopped making them for quite a long time. So recently he came out with a pack of I think six hairs. So I'm going to show you them all now. Clarified hair means it's using an alpha hair as a base. So this is the alpha hair it's using. And then it was made to look a little bit more like clay, more like Maxis Match. So it suits your Maxis Match game better. So this is the first one. I love it. Super long, a little bit wavy. Then we've got this one again super cute. These are all from the same post Obsessed with this one by the way with the two braids. love that one Then we've got this one which is more of an up to you with the braid really really pretty And then we have got this one another really really long hairstyle I realized I forgot to show one put one on one of these outfits. So let me find that one. This was the last hair Okay, so this one I totally forgot about but this is the last clear hair again an updo a shorter one really really cute next up we've got the Kira hair this one is so cute love the space buns love these little bits of hair in the front we've got like fringe braids going on and another ombre if you want this looks so good on Dahlia by the way like all these hairs do but here is the ombre accessory again Oh, I don't know if these are the same colors, but oh my god, love it. Love the more pastel swatches. So cute. Yup, we've got more ombre. So this is the Harper hair, which is one of my new favorites. Absolutely obsessed with this hair. It looks so good on pretty much any sim. And this one goes with a different ombre that is linked in the post that I will be linking down below. So if you want to download the ombre, it is totally possible. It also comes with these little hairpins that you can add on if you want. I think they're really cute. I like these for loads of different hairs. And again, you've got a lot of different color options so you can match your outfit. Then we've got the Amira hair. This one is really cute. It's again using the same little strands of hair in the front that I really, really like. And it's kind of like a Maxis Match version of the clarified hair I showed you guys. Love the braids. And you can change the color of the hair ties if you want to. Loads of different options here. Then we've got the Amala hair by Vikai. This one's really cute. Again, got some French braids going on. Oh my God, they come all the way to the back. We've got space buns and these little braid bits of hair in the front. This one's super cute. Next up is the Cali hair by Green Llamas. It looks like this, kind of like a 
It's not a side ponytail, but it's pulled to the side with little uh, bangs as well. This one's super cute. This is another Green Lava's hair. This is the Lana hair. This is what it looks like. Quite realistic, casual hairstyle. I think it's really, really cute. I basically think everything is cute, so I can see that for all of these hairs. This is called the Hallie hair. Another realistic, simple, casual hairstyle. I think from a creator I have not downloaded from before, but it looks really good. And this hair is the Julia hair. This is by Feral Poodles. This comes in a different version. I think it had like French braids or something going on. I forgot, but this is cool. Yeah, I've run out of clothes. She's in her underwear, but it's definitely like a showstopper. Oh my God, it looks so good. And you've got so many different color options too. This is the Domino hair by Simon D, who is one of my favorite hair CC creators. So this is a shorter one with different bangs. Here is another one by Simon D. This is called the Sleepy Hair, and I love this one. Look at these bangs. I'm obsessed with them. The little hair tie at the back. It's quite a long hairstyle. And yeah, it comes with this different color swatch that you can add to the hair. So this is the normal swatch, and then in half, so you can download this, and it makes like a part of the hair a different color, and I thought that was quite cool and unique. So you can do a lot with this hair. From Simon D again, we've got this hair next. This is called the Wanderlust hair. Really, really cute. Love the bangs. And again, from Simon D, this is the Deep Sea hair. I basically download all of her hairs. They are so, so cool. Love this one. Look at the detail on the sides. And this one comes in an ombre version too. Oh my God, here it was. So this is the one with the ombres or the highlights. I think these are basically the colors that we got with uh, The Sims for Island Living. And then we've got this hair, which I showed up in the thumbnail because I am obsessed with this Primrose hair by Feral Poodles. This is so, so cool. Look how good it looks on Dahlia with the red flowers, red lipstick, red eyes. It is gorgeous. So it has this add-on with the flowers and like the vines going through the hair, which I've never seen before, which I thought was such a cool and unique idea. So this is in the hats category. This is the hair without them. It's still a really pretty hair, but if you want to be a little bit extra, you can add this. And I'm just obsessed and blown away by this. All right, two hairs left. They're both space buns. First up is this bonnie hair by Grim Cookies. I've got quite a few hairs that are similar to this, but I thought this one was really, really good quality. And then lastly, we've got the Cleo hair by OK Roo. And this is an area of the hair we've got from Realm of Magic. Again, with space buns. I just think this one is really cool and unique. All right, that is all the hairs for today, Susie Hua. Moving on to accessories. I've got some new jewelry. So starting off with these square-tacular earrings. Really, really cool, simple, chic. I like them a lot. They come in metallic swatches. Oh my god, and then the necklace. This is by Christopher067. Love it. It's so pretty. Again, like quite small and simple. Can go with so many different outfits. I love it a lot. And then next up, I've got another pair of earrings from Christopher as well. These are called the North Star earrings, and they're a set of earrings, as you can see. They include a lot of different earrings, but you've got the star theme going on. There's also kind of a matching necklace, this choker, which is so, so pretty. Again, this will just go with so many different looks. I love it with the little stars, so this is the Romeo necklace. And then also from Christopher, I've got these sweetheart earrings. I don't know how well you can see them, but they're cute little hearts. And they've got like little diamonds on them and they're super pretty. For accessories, I've also got this jacket separated from one of the new base game outfits. So basically you just add this on top of your whatever clothes you want. And this is really cool. I think the creator added a few more swatches in here and it looks really good, really well done. And as you can see, it goes perfectly with this outfit. All right, let's move on to tops and bottoms, etc. So first up, I want to showcase the A and A collection between Aoshi and Harris OO Brittany. I still don't know how you're supposed to say that username, but I'm gonna link the post down below. It has a bunch of new clothes, and I think it has hairs. 
there's just a lot to choose from. There's clothes for guys as well. I didn't download everything because I am super picky because my game is about to explode from the amount of CC I've got. So all the items from this collection have this little pink icon at the top. So first up, we've got this really, really cute crop top, which I think is adorable. Looks so good. Then we've got this tiny little ruffle bandeau top, which again, super cute. It comes in two versions. This one has the two different colors and this one is solid. And here is the palette for this collection. Really, really cute. Love the pastels especially. And here we've got another top, pretty simple one that's tied in a knot. So it's basically a crop top in the same swatches as seen before. While we're talking about the collection, I'm going to show you guys the bottoms as well that I downloaded. So first up, we've got this pair of jeans that come in lots of fun colors as well, which I don't have that many jeans that have this much variety. So I really like them. Pretty simple with a belt and high-waisted. I love high-waisted clothes. Here are the shorts from the collection. So these are again, high-waisted in the same swatches and they do come in patterns as well. I downloaded both of them. There's a bunch of different really cute and adorable swatches in here. You can make super cute outfits with this. And then we've got the denim skirt from the collection as well. High-waisted, really, really high quality. Looks really, really good and comes in a bunch of denim swatches. And lastly, from the collection, I downloaded this Nicole swimsuit, which I know we're supposed to be going through the tops right now, but I just wanted to show you this all at once because it is all in the same pot. So this one is really cute, comes in the same swatches as seen before. I like it a lot. All right, so moving on from that collection to another collection with Osin, and this time it was with Ball of Plum Bob. So they have this little icon. I downloaded a few pieces from this collection as well. First up, this crop top with a bit of a turtleneck. Really cute, and it comes in patterns which are so, so pretty as well. I also downloaded this off the shoulder top with the buttons. I really like the palette for this collection too, especially the pastels. I always love them. Next up, we've got this top, which is called the Zio top. I don't know how to pronounce that, but it's really, really cute crop top. Um, I don't know what this material or texture is called, but I love it. So you can see it has a very pastel -y, uh, swatch palette here, which I love. Oh my gosh, it looks great in yellow. And you can download it in these five pattern swatches too, which I really liked. Okay, next up, we've got this Vibe Halter bodysuit by Triliki. You can't really see it because she's wearing an overall dress, which I will show you in a second, but you can see the picture here. It's just a pretty simple halter bodysuit with a high turtleneck and this material, which I love. I love when there's a bit of texture to clothing in the Sims. I just feel like it adds a lot and it has a really nice color palette too. Then for winter or awesome, we're getting ready. We've got this Bonnie jacket, which looks really cute. I like the fur detailing. And you've got a lot of different swatches here. A lot of these are not patterned. And then if you go down here, you've got a couple of patterned ones too, like that one, love it. Then we've got this denim jacket separated from the same base game outfit as the accessory jacket, but this one is in the top section and it has the t-shirt underneath. I think it's the original swatches, but it was just like such a nice jacket that I really wanted to have it in my game and be able to match it with whatever bottoms I wanted. So like this one a lot. And then lastly for tops, we have got this t-shirt by Kuberson. This is called the Guy Tee. And it's pretty simple. It has a lot of swatches, as you can see. So if you're looking for a good basic t-shirt, this could be the one for you. It also has some pattern swatches, as you can see down here, or more like printed swatches. And we've got a lot of different options for a lot of different kind of sims. So I think this is pretty cool. All right, moving on to bottoms. So I already showed you guys the a, a collection. Next up, we've got this skirt by Jilliki. This is called the Attaboy skirt. I love it. It's again, high-waisted, which I love with these little ruffles or frills at the bottom in Jilliki's usual color palette and some of these patterned swatches too. I'm basically obsessed with this skirt as you can see. 
Then actually to match this top, we've got a matching skirt. This is called the Tory skirt and again, high-waisted, obsessed, and it comes in the same colors. So basically you can make like a two-piece outfit that looks really good and here are the same patterned ones and like this one is just gorgeous. And then the overall dress that I was talking about. So this is in the bottoms category, which is so useful. I love it. It looks so, so cute. I think this is by Richport. It doesn't go with all tops, obviously, because it might have some things cutting into each other. So just make sure you find like a more of a flat, simple top underneath. But this one, it goes with perfectly. And it comes in different denim swatches and your white and your black. All right, so for outfits, I've got a couple of different ones to show you guys today. And not that many, but the first one we've got is this wall flower dress by Richboard. Really, really cute. I, I just I just think it's really super adorable. It comes in loads of different cute, pastel-y, colorful swatches and two patterned ones too. Then we've got this Get Aloud suit by Chiliki, which is just, again, adorable with shorts, matching suit jacket, and comes in a couple of those pattern swatches and loads of plain swatches too. And then as we're getting closer and closer to Halloween, which I'm quite excited for, can't wait to make some Halloween videos and excited for St. Blurine Halloween CC, but to get a taste, we've got this Nalina dress by Chiliki. And this one, as you can see from some of these swatches, is definitely getting in the Halloween spirit. It's a pretty basic, simple dress with a Peter Pan color, but like this swatch really spoke to me and I think it's really cute, but yeah, this whole be great for Halloween or as you can see it has some plain swatches too so it is quite versatile and then the last item in today's haul is a pair of shoes I do not find new shoes often and this time I only got one pair to show you guys so these are by Onyx Sims these are actually the Air Force ones and these ones come for children and toddlers as well I believe and you have got so many different color options are all of these even real like can you buy these in real life, I'm not sure, but you've got the basic white ones that everyone's been loving. So there you go. And that is it for today's CC haul. I hope you guys found something you liked. As always, everything is linked down below in the order that I showed it, you guys. Anyways, if you enjoyed, give the video a thumbs up. I would really appreciate it. And if you are new here, consider subscribing as well. I post new Sims videos about three times a week. But that is it for me today. Thank you so, so much for watching. I'll be back with another CC haul in about a month or so but in the meantime i'll see you in my next video bye this time i'm a win it this time i'm a win it but my